Kintasha <laughs> Cogar Hionio Ig Agusson an Clehesa a Tacht de Joe Derrick is Tocha big Nartina Queen of Ver Corkig Agus Consmar Hawke son as Consmar Vega Coen Vinci Huin Neil to a Gimmert Fellar Hunt to Fosse Gimmert Lesson Globe Banish Thor Nuish Dig Megan Kinne Legend of Nu Avana to Lesson Kinne Hodenta Capus Capus Garinus Yadana Kinne Jimmy Barry Murphy or Ono Mar Banish Thor Yeah look Okay, fair comedy of Shane O'Donoghue. I'd say Rakish in a high cool key to Oh! Well, more Evan William Murphy fighting Black Tear Ribisha, Hosha, Kinta fighting Nishika, Hand of Fair Hand, and like half way to Dag, Captain Shane Maloney, Hand and Nay fighting Yoviga, on a score. And 21 points, Dublin, one goal and 12. There was eight minutes gone before we registered our first score, you know, so... And at that stage, Dub Dublin, even though they had only one point in the board, they had three or four very good chances. We could have been four or five points down at that time. But uh, thankfully, we worked and harried and put them under a lot of pressure and cut out the supply of the ball to their forwards. So that was, uh, that was it's a very simple game plan if you can do it. At the beginning of the year, if you'd asked me, you know, would we get to an all Ireland final, look, I wouldn't have been able to say it. You know, but I mean, as the year went on, we kind of felt our confidence grew. And as a group, we, we grew in confidence. And like the 16 of that group eligible again next year. So like the future is bright. Post and, did a lot of good, and that's Parry Brenny. Okay, well, he's standing by now to be presented with his Man of the Match award. Well, a sixth All Ireland title for Matty Murphy, and he presents the GA Man of the Match to his midfielder, Porrick Brenny. Congratulations, Porrick. Don't let it drop, whatever else you do. Porrick, uh, Dublin came at you very hard in the, those early minutes, but it was the wides, I suppose, and you could nearly see the heads drop, but uh, your head certainly didn't drop and you drove on. Yeah, like, we knew we were coming, like, we were under no illusions. This, this is a great Dublin team, like, in the, in the first 10 minutes, like, they were really coming at us left, right and centre, like, you know, they had just a few bad wides, and the, the, you're right, the heads probably did go down a bit, but look at, we had a bit of luck on the day, and we're just absolutely delighted we came away with the win. One of the things that struck me looking at this game today was, I suppose, the depth in your, tan in your panel. Jack Carr, um, who came in against Antrim, who came in the last day and did so well, he really took his chance today. He was there as a fulcrum of most of your attacks in there, and with Maloney off him, I know Donoghue, you really got rewards. Yeah, we did. Like, we know, like, we've trained so hard all year, and we have a great panel of players there. Like, we, we've worked so hard, and like, Jack, fair play to him. Like, he, he took his chance today. He took his chance the last day. Like, like the full four line, they really clicked today, and just thank God we, uh, we clicked as a unit. And, just delighted with the win, that's all. 
You were saying to me there in 2009 you picked up a medal, but I suppose you were central to everything that Galway did well today, so I presume this medal means all the more to you. Ah, it's, it's nice, look, it's, it's, it's great to get it, like, but it was a real team performance, a real team effort all through, like, and look, it's nice to get this, but um, again, like, uh, we just, we worked so hard and thank God it paid off today. Well, well done, Porik, and the best of luck. Uh, enjoy the night and enjoy tomorrow the homecoming. Okay, thank you very much. much.